Hello and welcome to Insta Blogs Global Report. This is Sukhmani with fresh updates and more citizen voices from all over the world. Stories of the day are: Malvi Kabir, the notorious Taliban leader, arrested by Pakistani police. United States and Mexican authorities initiate joint border patrolling to fight drug crime and illegal immigration. And Jordanian authorities try to contain the oil spill in the Gulf of Aqaba. Pakistani police have arrested another Taliban leader, Malvi Kabir, one of the 10 most wanted militants and former governor of the Afghanistan province of Nangar. Sijia Karim Khan says that for once the Pakistani police have proved its worth in handling the homeland security. This is Sijia Karim Khan on Insta blogs from Peshawar in Pakistan. The police department in most parts of the country is notorious for indulging in bribery and persecuting civilians but in some instances Pakistani police has proved its worth for the nation and homeland security the arrest of Malvi Kabir in Noshera is one such instance Malvi Kabir has been one of the most wanted Taliban commanders to the world leaders of the current war on terror by arresting Kabir the NWFP police has demonstrated their worth in curbing terrorism in and outside of the country where they need is support and training by skilled international security professionals as well as advanced technology for acting against criminals and terrorists arresting a highly wanted terrorist leader like Malvi Kabir is something for which the NWFP police deserves a reward from the international community at the same time media in the country needs to be free in covering important news relating national security without risking the safety of its journalists and anchors Mexico's homeland and public security secretaries have signed a declaration in Mexico City to expand partnership between US Border Patrol and Mexico's federal police. The CJ has more on the story from Mexico. US Border Patrol and Mexican federal agents have been sharing intelligence and working patrols together for the first time in a joint effort to crack down on drug smuggling, weapon smuggling, and illegal immigration. Homeland Security Secretary Janet Napolitano and Mexican Public Safety Secretary Genaro Garcia Luna signed a declaration Thursday in Mexico City that would expand the new partnership between the US Border Patrol and Mexico's federal police that began in recent months. Officials say that eventually joint operations on both sides of the border could lead to the creation of a Mexican force serving as a counterpart to the US Border Patrol. A major goal of the partnership is to help Mexico fight violent drug cartels, which are often better funded and more heavily armed than Mexican police. Jordanian authorities are frantically trying to contain an oil spill discovered by a team of Royal Marine Conservation Society near the Gulf of Aqaba. CJ Wade Buzoeg gives us more on the story from Jordan. Jordanian authorities rushed last Thursday to try and contain an oil spill which was discovered by teams from the Royal Marine Conservation Society near Aqaba. The source of the oil spill is yet to be determined as more focus is being geared towards containing the pollution and finding out the affected area which is reported to be a few kilometers in the southern beach. A pipe malfunction of a tanker offloading oil is suspected to be the source of the spill. The incident's impact on marine life is not determined yet as it is still being investigated but needs to be targeted as soon as possible. If you want your voice to be heard by millions, let InstaBlogs be your choice. You can contact us at cj@instablogs.com. That's all for today's show. We'll be back with fresh updates and more citizen voices. Till then, it's goodbye from the entire team of Global Report.